Tupac. Um, my mother, you know, when she had when she gave birth to me, she was just coming out of jail, being in jail because they was holding her for the trial. So she had all these females, these women, strong women around her, and she was like, "What am I going to name my son?" And it was this lady who just came from Peru, and she was telling my mother this folk story about this a true life Peruvian revolutionary named Tupac Amaro, who. The government had told them, okay, we, we wanted, they, he was fighting the government, and he was really winning. These little fucking tribes was beating the government. And they said, okay, we want to stop fighting. We want to meet with Tupac Amaro. He came in and met with them, and they said, we want to cease the fighting. Would you please cease the fighting? Too many people are dying. We're going to give you what you asked for. He said, okay. Told them to cease fire. As soon as they said cease fire, they cut his arms off, cut his head off, cut his legs off, and stuck him on a stick and put him in the middle of the village. So this is my reminder. That's my reminder. Every time you say my name, that's my reminder to never compromise myself and never quit. There's no such thing as a truce while people ain't free, regardless of who it is.